Tesla had a rough day today. The stock rose from $248 to $265 intraday, but closed at $252 at the end of the trading session. That can be a good price for many to acquire some shares, but if you want to buy Tesla or any other stock at a shockingly discounted price, a much lower price, stick around. Buying a stock at its market price is dangerous. Buying a volatile stock like Tesla at its market price is more dangerous than that. You may be in red the following hour, day, or week. While this is the true nature of the stock market, you can follow a specific strategy to minimize your risk by buying the stock at a discounted price. More importantly, you could say you do not want to buy any Tesla stock until the stock falls to a specific price, say $230 per share. The best part of this is that you can expect to be compensated for buying the stock at that low price. If Tesla does not come down to that price, you still want to be compensated for your contract. All of this is possible through following sophisticated but easy-to-understand trading rules. It is not only Tesla, you can buy any stock for your portfolio at a cheaper price following this strategy. However, for this tutorial, we will use Tesla as an example. Let us put this in perspective. The first element is Tesla's current price, which is $252. The second element is you want to buy Tesla at $230. The third element is time. By what time you want to buy Tesla stock at $230 per share. The fourth element is how much at the maximum you can be compensated for buying Tesla at that price by that time. To put this in financial language, current price, $252. Strike price, $230. Expiration, one month, six months, one year. This is the time you give Tesla to come down to $230. Premium, the money you will receive in return for buying Tesla at $230. Remember that the premium becomes higher or lower based on the expiration date. Let's visit the NASDAQ website to find out how much discount you can gain from this strategy. We have Tesla's option chain before me. It has two sides, calls and puts. Since we want the Tesla share price to come down, we are interested only in the put side of the page at this time. We will sell put options to receive a premium. We will transfer the data to a table to get the picture at a glance. If we want to buy Tesla shares about a month from now at $230 per share, we will receive a premium of $8.65. The expiration date for this option will be the 16th of August, 2024. Let's move to the put option, expiring roughly in the next six months. The date will be the 17th of January, 2025, and the premium will be $24.50. As you can see, the longer time you can give Tesla to come within your budget, the higher the premium becomes. Thus, the premium for the put options expiring on June 20, 2025, is $33.94 per share. Options are sold in contracts. Each contract contains 100 shares. That means you will receive $865 for a put option contract expiring in one month $2,450 for a six-month contract, and as much as $3,394 for a contract expiring in one year. This is according to today's market rate. How does that affect the stock price of Tesla for you? Since you have received this amount of premium in advance, if you buy Tesla as part of the options agreement, your actual buy price for Tesla will be $221.35 for one-month put options, $205.50 for six-month put options, and $196.06 for one-year put options. You will receive the shares at $230 per share only if Tesla trades at or below that price at the close of the trading sessions on your options expiration dates. Tesla may not hit $230 in the next one month, six months, or one year. If it does not, the premium is yours to keep. Thus, you will gain a 14.76% return 
on your investment of $23,000 for a one-year put option without buying any Tesla shares. After any of the expiration dates I just mentioned, you will sell put options again. You will continue selling put options until Tesla comes within $230 and your broker assigns you the shares. You don't need to choose one month, six months, or a year expiration. You can choose as little as one week, two weeks, three weeks, and as much as months and even years for your put options. In the same way, you can choose different strike prices, higher or lower strikes than Tesla's current market price. Learn more about options trading, choose your strikes carefully, and don't buy any stocks without selling put options first. Thank you for watching this far. If you like my content, please consider subscribing to my channel. It means a lot to me. Also, consider liking this video, and if you have time, watch more videos on money, trading, and investing by going to my channel homepage. Goodbye.